Hey, what's up? Boogeyman101 here, showing you guys a Call of Duty Black Ops 3 respawn glitch from the map The Giant. So, the first thing I did here was get a gobble gum called Impatient. And now, if you don't know what that gobble gum is, basically what it does is if you die, you get to respawn before the round ends, after the last zombie spawns. So, later in the game, I died. So, I re when I respawned, I ended up in the pack-a-punch room. I decided to upgrade my guns to death and taxes because I had enough money. Of course, this method was great because I could blow up the zombies and, of course, you know, survive to the next round. Unfortunately, with there being little zombies, finding them and baiting them to get killed is extremely difficult, but I was able to do it because of the power of patience which is kind of ironic but anyways so after this round is over one of the players decides to let me out because I was just stuck in that small little metal room now what I found interesting is the zombies that were supposed to come after me just went to these central places near where I was but not exactly where I was at so they would gather around the teleporter, or they gather around on top of the stairway, which I found interesting. I'm not exactly sure why. And Kino Dare Toten, there was a weird glitch that you could do. If you stand in a certain spot, the zombies would run away from you. I'm not exactly sure why they did, or how this happened, but this reminded me of that sort of glitch. As you can see, he lets me go, and it was not too long after this when I downed myself because of the splash damage of the Death and Taxes guns. So that is the most bizarre and interesting glitch I've ever seen in Zombies, especially with a new release like this. I'm not sure if this glitch is intentional or if this is done only with impatient gobblegum or if this happens when the player is near the starting room when the round ends, who knows. I'm not exactly sure, I haven't tried it more than once. If you guys decide to give this a try and see how it goes, let me know how that turns out. And I'd actually like to see if you could replicate what I just did. So thank you guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed this.